Hello YouTubers, this is Hammy Technoid, and today I'm going to do a little bit about the uh, Raspberry Pi I got running in my living room here on my big screen. And you see, as you just watched, it booted up into a program that's running called Open Elect. And that is this, the program that I use to run my media center through my Raspberry Pi. And also what makes it very handy to uh, run the Raspberry Pi is one of these little keyboards, which you can only see the silhouette right now, but I'm going to post a picture of it there. Okay, and uh, with the keyboard, this is a wireless keyboard, so I'm in the Raspberry Pi, I have a little wireless receiver, and I'm transmitting from the keyboard, and I can change things, and I can go from music, which it boots up into by default, or I can go to video and other program things and system and what I wanted to show you today was the system settings because it's very important if you want to show movies or play surround sound movies and or surround sound music which I love to do you got to get into the settings and make some changes okay and all these here are important or not so important but the one that I'm critically concerned with here is the one way down at the bottom that says system so we enter system, okay, and in video output, eh, you can set those. You want to make sure it's good, but my concern is the audio today. So what we're going to do, audio output device, we make sure that that's on HDMI. You see, you can have it set to something else, analog or HDMI or both, but we want HDMI. Now this is the one here, okay, number of channels. We got 5.1, baby. We got surround sound 5.1. But see, you can go up as high as 7.1. If you got an Atmos system or something like that, you can go to 7.1. But we're concerned with 5.1. Now, that's where we are. And I'm going to go back to escape there. And we're back. We're going to go back to music and click down to files. And then I wanted to show you something here. I've got three. What's, I've got two. Two hard drives. And I believe the one I want is called Lexar. Okay, there we are. Going down to the music. Click on music. And I got a song here called Hair and Dance. It's played in the, I'll play it in the background. But it's recorded in 5.1. And it's going to play. And see, that's, that's playing now. And if I want to go to a different song, I can go to Gray Zone. And that song will play. Okay. Genesis progresses. You can go to that one. I like Heron's Heron Dance. That's a funny song. That's what I said at the hoop dabba dow. Yeah. I love that language. Uh, anyway, okay, so we're uh, going to get out of the music, up to the top, and get out of that. Now, if you're in the music setting and you got videos, guess what? The videos don't show. There's nothing there because you're in the music folder. Okay, so let's let's go back to this setting here. We're going to go into videos now and look for some files. Okay, and go back to Lexar and the music where we were before. Now, that file doesn't show up because we're not looking for music. We're looking for videos. So now we're going to go back up here to Bob's Burgers. I got Bob's Burgers. So we're going to look, look, look at some Bob's Burgers here. And because, uh, let's see, Spooky Day is coming. We'll look at the one that has Spooky Day. And let me go fast forward a little bit. Yeah, Spooky Day. Everybody dresses up on Spooky Day. So, yeah. And there's some Bob's Burgers there. So I'm going to go back to that. Back to the beginning. Oops, now I gotta get back to tab. Tab, tab, then tab, then tab. Yeah, okay. And stop, and boom. I don't wanna get flagged by YouTube for copyright infringement, because I'm just using this as fair use, okay? So anyway, we go back to the beginning, and there's video. And uh, You can show pictures on here if you want. I don't do pictures, I just do videos and music. So this is my demo today of my Raspberry Pi in my living room, and I enjoy it immensely. I watch it all the time. I like to download videos from YouTube and put them on here on a, on a thumb drive, and I can watch them anytime I want. I don't have to use up my bandwidth or, you know, watch uh, YouTube stuff. I can do it whenever I want. 
So, uh, yeah, if you have a Raspberry Pi, it's a good Christmas present. Get yourself a good Christmas present or somebody you know who's into video or uh, media and wants to play. Uh, Raspberry Pi is an excellent present. Excellent, I suggest. So, anyway, until next time, see you later.